Hello everyone, I'm Olga Vaskan and welcome to our virtual English class. Today we will focus our attention to the activities that we do in the morning, in the afternoon, in the evening, on Monday, on Tuesday. So, we will talk about my week agenda. This is our plan. If you need to take notes, take your pens, copy books, make yourselves comfortable and let's start. And let us start with the parts of the day. The first part of the day is morning. Dimineața. Morning. Afternoon. Afternoon. După amiază. Evening. Evening. Seara. Night. Noaptea. So, morning, afternoon, evening, night. It's morning. Let us see how do people greet in the morning. And we say, good morning. It's afternoon. And we say, good afternoon. Let us start with parts of the day. And the first part of the day is morning. Morning. Dimineața. Afternoon. Afternoon. După amiază. Evening. Evening. Seara. Night. Night. Noaptea. So, it's morning. How do we greet in the morning? And we greet, good morning, everyone. It's afternoon. And we say, good afternoon. It's evening. And we say, good evening. It's night. And when we go to bed, we say, good night. The next vocabulary word is, get up. Asi trezi. Get up. Get dressed. Get dressed. I se îmbrăca. Have breakfast. Have breakfast. Okay, so these are the words we will work with today. The next activity, I want to challenge you a little bit. Look and say. I will show you the part of the day and your task is to say how do we greet in this very part of the day. Let's start. What is this? It's morning, you are right. How do we greet in the morning? Good morning, very good. Let's continue. Afternoon, good job. Good afternoon. This is evening. And we say, good evening, very good. It's night. And we say, good night. Good job. Uh, now, meet Tim. He is very happy. And he does a lot of things during the week. Let us see what he does. Let's read, but be very attentive, because after reading, he will have to answer some questions. Let's start. And you can read together with me. On Monday, I get up early. I get dressed and have breakfast. I pick up my backpack and go to school. On Sunday, I don't get up early. I put on my t-shirt and jeans. I take my bike and go to the park. My friends are in the park. We play ball, run and jump. We have fun. This is what Tim does during the week. 
Let us read the text once again. But this time, some of the words are missing. Let us guess what the missing word is. Let's start. On Monday, I... Right you are. Get up early. I get... Mm, what's the hidden word? Dressed and have breakfast. I pick up my backpack and go to school. On Sunday, I don't get up early. Good job. I write you up, put on my t-shirt and jeans. I take my bike and go to the park. My mm, cars my toys, no, my friends are in the park. We play ball, run and good job, jump. We have fun. I knew that you could do this at a finger snap. Very good. And now let us continue. And here you can see Alex's week agenda. So have a look at it. And here we also have three suns of different colors. The yellow sun refers to morning. The orange or red sun refers to afternoon. And the blue sun refers to evening. Imagine that you are Alex. I will ask you some questions. You have to follow the agenda and answer. So, let's start. Alex, what do you do on Thursday morning? And the answer is, I read. Very good. Alex, what do you do on Saturday morning? I ride my bike. If you have this answer, then it's correct. What do you do? On Monday afternoon, I do my homework. Very good. And the last question is, mm, what do you do on Sunday evening? I draw on Sunday evening. Very good. Excellent performance. And my next suggestion for you is, try to design your own week agenda so you have the example on your screens, stick it somewhere on the fridge and try to keep track of the activities you do during the week. I am sure that you are very busy people. So that is all for today. Have fun and learn English. See you soon.